Hello, Association for Women in Communication. Thank you for breaking and entering into my home and joining me today while we will be creating a lovely, simple frittata with a few ingredients you are certain to have around the house, including fake sugar, doggy tranquilizers, and of course, paint samples. Ah, yes. What is that you ask? What do I have here? Is it my latest novel? Indeed it is. Hang on. Hang on. We have Angelina Jolie joining us. Hello, Angelina. She has a comment. What is it? You're kidding! Angelina Jolie would just like to say that my novel lasts longer than Brad Pitt in bed. Thank you, Angelina. I will use that as a blur. All right, since you all have taken the time to break and enter my home and security has not arrived yet, I am going to share with you a few of my secrets of creativity. Come with me now. The first place, and possibly the most important places that ideas come from, is the shower head. I guarantee, get in, suds up, the ideas will stream down. Voila, creativity. And oh yes, the cover of my latest novel, all authors have them, waterproofed. Let's go and look now at the next place where ideas come from. The next place that ideas come from is of course the steering wheel. Don't you get your best ideas while you're driving and ignoring the kids yelling in the back seat? when you're carpooling, a steering wheel. Number three, come on, let's go. The last place a creative person gets her ideas from, the pillow. Mm. They just start flowing right in from the fiber fill. Also, let me call your attention to the great tower of books incredible source of ideas. They're chock full of them. Words that people have used and have completely forgotten about. Okay, some may call it plagiarism. Some may say, why Sarah, you stole the beginning of Tale of Two Cities. And I said, did I write it was the best of times, the worst of times? No, I wrote it might have been the best of times, possibly could have been the worst of times. No plagiarism. Fantastic source of ideas. Keep these in mind. Hey, let's go see how our frittata is doing. The frittata is smelling delicious. Meanwhile, before security arrives, I want to emphasize, please invite you all to join me at the Association for Women Communicators Luncheon, where I promise to turn you from a zero into a hero. And if not that, I promise to do three things. One, I will force you to eat your dessert silently while I speak. Two, I will prohibit you from having a delightful conversation with anyone around you. Number three, guaranteed, I will take 20 to 30 minutes of your life that you will never get back. One last thing. What's that? Angelina Jolie is going to be there. Please join us. <laughs>